SEC fans will be in Music City this week for the big men's basketball tournament here. The games start Wednesday and will bring a big economic boost to the city. Amelia Young's here now with more big week, especially for ball fans. Oh yeah, Jennifer, you had to throw that in there, how to say go Vols this morning, just because they obviously clinched the title for regular season champs. This week come in a whole different ball game though with the SEC men's basketball tournament right here in Music City. Of course, we'll know the champions on Sunday, but all of this going down over at Bridgestone Arena Wednesday through Sunday. Each day, of course, there's gonna be a lot of action on and off the court. The popular SEC party and the park party is gonna be next door to Bridgestone next weekend, Friday and Saturday, ahead of that championship game on Sunday. Hotels all across town are booked, not just for SEC men's basketball tournament, but also spring break. So this is just a week that a lot of people are here for, a lot of fans are traveling for, so much so that back in 2019, this tournament alone was a nearly $24 million impact on the city. Of course, m more hotels have been built since, meaning more people are gonna travel here. Music City has been the home of the tournament since 2013 with exceptions for a few years and will be the home until at least 2030 with the option to extend into at least 2035. That's expected to bring in $350 million with 3.2 million fans filling 200,000 hotel rooms. Of course, it's just a big, big week in Music City. We're over at BNA this morning just looking at all the people leaving town. Of course, people are going to be coming into town this week. Keep you updated on that. Also, with the tournament, there's going to be a lot of road closers, so just make sure you're tuning in to New Channel 5 this morning all week long to make sure you're prepared for those if you're going downtown. Jennifer. Yeah, thank